football has the power to enthrall, to captivate, and this occasion appears irresistible. Two magnificent sides intent upon impressing the wider world with a display of technical and tactical brilliance. So much riding on this. Don't go anywhere. We'll see you for all the action on EA TV. And a warm welcome from a venue that really oozes football history. I'm talking, of course, about the San Siro in Milan. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on live action from Italy's top division, Serie A. It's Inter, and they take on Empoli. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Well, spot on with that challenge. In position and pushed away to safety. And this is how it looks for Inter. Jan Zommer is the goalkeeper. Francesco Acerbi plays alongside Alessandro Bastoni in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays with Henrik Mkhitaryan in the centre of midfield. And in attack, Marcus Turam plays alongside Lautaro Martinez. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, when you play in a 3-5-2 formation, the position of the wing-backs is key. If they drop too deep, you can't dominate possession. And if they play too high, you leave the centre-backs exposed. They have to get the balance right. Oh, they could be in here, Stuart. Well, we always try to be fair about it, but that really should have been 1-0 early on here. Well, what a chance. That would have been a great start for them. De Frey. Well, I must say, Stuart, every reason to believe this will be one-sided. Our hosts are the most prolific goal scorers in the league, while their opponents have the poorest return of any front line. Yeah, and it's going to be interesting to see how they come here and cope with this brilliant forward line. They'll have to defend really well because this could be a tough match for them, I think. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Well, he keeps going and threading it through not too fussy in clearing his lines Inter in a position of menace can he take advantage oh yes 1-0 it is and it doesn't come as a huge surprise Well, just look how exposed the keeper is. He's got absolutely no chance there, but they do take it well, you have to say. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Alberto Cherry. Trying to open up the defence. Can he do it from miles out? Oh, what an astonishing goal! Almost from a different postal code. That was as clean as a whistle. You cannot strike them any better than that. Well, we won't get tired of seeing this, will we? Because that struck so sweetly. He really does surprise everybody here, not least the keeper. What a good finish that is. Back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Alberto Cherry. And he's broken free. 
Main priority to hit the target, but couldn't do so. Well, he'd certainly like to have that back again. That was a big chance missed. Alberto Grassi, Alberto Cherry, and the referee playing advantage. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Sebastian Vadukiewicz. It's with Chalanolu. And that is going to be a free kick. I'll tell you what, that is really top class defending. Ismaili. Male. Alberto Cherry, committed challenge. Adiani Smiley. Well, the referee allowing the play to flow. Good tackle taken away. Now, what can Inter do from this position? In with a chance. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And I think the threat has been averted. Well, that could easily have finished the game off, but what an excellent save that was. Bartosz Bereszynski into regaining possession. Firing it towards goal! And the referee says corner kick. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And there's the delivery. And putting paid to the danger. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Incredible clearance. I must say, I didn't see that coming. Just the challenge that was required. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. He's in position. How about the cross? Well cleared away. Well, they might be able to launch a counter-attack. Well, lovely work to get past his man. Feeding it through. And still danger here. Will he? There it is, and he could scarcely have had an easier finish. Well, here it is again, and you have to say, he looks so uncomfortable with the ball at his feet. He's cost his team a goal here. Well, underway again, it's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. And the first half is in the history books here at the Meazza.
So the second half underway, and Inter looking to build upon a largely positive first half performance. Barella. Now, will the cross work out for them? Did well to clear it away. Barella. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Caputo. Well, is it going to end up being productive for them? Luperto. A fine use of the ball. Promising sequence. Can they take advantage? Textbook defending inside the box. Grassi. Well, since they have the ball, a referee playing advantage here. Can't miss, surely! Oh, a goal! The equaliser! They've completely changed the equation! Well, as you can see, he's given far too much space, but he still had some work to do, and I think that's a very tidy finish. It was never in doubt. So the ball is running again at 2 all. Francesco Acerbi. Great ball over the top. Oh, last ditch defending at its very finest. Mkhitaryan. Nicely timed tackle. Youssef Male. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. And saved by the keeper. Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. And the substitution will occur now. Playing it in. Goalkeeper doing his job, getting the touch. And increasing the pressure, another corner it is. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. Now, perhaps they can counter from here. And the counter-attack came to nothing. Valukiewicz. Zhurkovsky. Now relying very much on their passing game in a bid to take the lead. Electing to shoot. Oh, he couldn't. And the referee has pointed to the spot. A penalty it is. And a chance for them to forge ahead. And into the book he goes too. Well, once he gave the penalty, he was always going to give him a yellow card. Chance then for 3-2. A goal! Accurate from the spot! Well, Inter get the ball rolling again. It's going to be interesting to see whether or not that goal stings them into action. Will he finish? Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Hmm. 20 minutes remaining. You 
Youssef Mali. No, high quality defending. Chance to cross. Jurovsky must take the lead here. He's blocked it. And the flag has gone up just when he looked ready to pounce, perhaps. Well, he was just too static in the end, which is a shame because that was a dangerous situation. Augusto. And Inter could get in behind the defence. For the lead here. And there's a quality defender in action. Alberto Grassi. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. And it's in! They're back in front! Stunning scenes here! Well, here it is again, and they've taken their goal well, but the defending was non-existent. That should never happen. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Zhukovsky. Giving it their all in search of an equaliser. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Well, what a fantastic save that was. He'll certainly be grabbing the headlines if it stays like this. Well, maybe a chance for them now to relieve the pressure by stringing a few passes together. Well, it might still work out for them. And a fine piece of goalkeeping which keeps their hopes alive. Well, you're right, that keeps them in it. But can they find an equaliser? They need some urgency in their play. Five minutes to go. An alert intervention. Barella. Grassi. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. This could be troublesome. This could finish it. And in all likelihood, that is game over. So little time left for a response. Let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And what a clinical finish this is from Lataro. He hits it with such power. That's a good goal. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Alberto Grassi. Male. And on to Caputo. Jurovsky. It has to be! And fine goalkeeping. <laughs> a chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. Just cleared away in the nick of time. And that will do it. The referee brings this match to an end. Inter entitled to be happy about this because they picked up maximum points from this game. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, they were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game. They defended well enough, they dominated midfield and they created chances as well. It was a great performance.